Hello, my name is Keith Baer. I'm Vice President for Financial Markets for IBM. We're here to talk about uh, the growth of collaborative networks focused on improving efficiencies and creating new business propositions for financial services. The example I'd like to talk about is the digital trade chain. Digital technology, cloud, blockchain, these are all technologies which are driving significant transformation in financial services. A set of banks have come together to solve one of the challenges within financial services, which is the small and medium enterprise part of transaction banking, only half of whom have access to any formal credit from their banks. We are building a blockchain environment that will exist between the banks. Uh, it will create trust and transparency between the small and medium enterprises that are served by each individual bank, therefore the, for the banks to offer more credit facilities than they might otherwise do so. So this is what the digital trade chain solution looks like in practice. We have a blockchain environment network in the middle, which all banks are connected to. And the banks in turn are connected to the SMEs who they have a banking relationship with. Therefore, if we have an SME over on the right here that is selling goods to another SME in a different country on the left-hand side here, then through a menu that is provided by IBM to the representative bank, the SME can place the order that they have. It will flow through the system to the other bank and then to the other SME. And as a result of this, there is trust and transparency in all aspects of the end-to-end -end trading relationship between the two SMEs. So how do we deliver the digital trade chain project and what technologies are we using? As we look at this diagram, we can see we're talking about a four-tier architecture. So at the center, we have the Hyperledger Fabric blockchain network, which is committing the order of transactions onto the ledger itself, onto the blockchain. This is supported on an IBM cloud. On the outer next ring, we have the uh, peers. These are the nodes within the blockchain network, one node per trading bank. We then have the application tier that interfaces downstream to the blockchain network itself and upstream to the user interface that is provided by the banks to give access to their clients. We're using API Connect to deliver and manage the interfaces. We also have the option of providing MQ as a messaging layer to interface into legacy systems. And then finally, the presentation layer, which is what the SME actually sees in the context of his transaction with the bank. The value to the market of the digital trade chain increases with the number of participants. Therefore, we fully expect the digital trade chain to expand in terms of banks and SMEs and geographically.